Mr. President, on immigration, what do you think America should do to, to, to make sure that immigrants can come to the country legally? Well, we're working on having reverse migration. We actually want Salvadorans to go back to our country. 60% of Salvadorans wants to go back. So we're going to work in that. I think that a country that has more people leaving than, than coming is a country that's failing. So we want our country to succeed. So more, more Salvadorans coming back and more people from other nationalities coming to our country instead of sending our, our people outside. It's a, it, it's a symptom of a, of a country that's going bad. And how can America be more humane to, to the immigrants that are trying to seek well, a better we have life? To be humane with, all human, with all people. So, of course, yes, we have to be humane. But uh, it's very important for not only the right to migrate, but also the right to stay. And we have to fight for the right that they have to stay in their own country instead of expelling people by, with, from a lot of countries because of crime, because of lack of economic opportunities. And we're just expelling our own. And that's not very humane. And a final question for you, Mr. President. North Korea and Russia met, and, and the war in Ukraine is going on. What is your message to President Putin and Kim Jong-un? I don't have any message to them. I just, for us, we don't play geopolitics. For us, it's peace with all of our friends and allies, and let's work together to find solutions. The war is not a, a topic that, that we can Thank, Thank you, Mr. President. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.